Good afternoon. We're learning more about the state police officer who was gunned down Friday morning on I-40 near Tucumcari, trying to help the driver accused of killing him. Officer Justin Hare was well known in several small New Mexico communities for helping anyone who needed it. News 13's Gabe Chavez spent today talking to those who knew the officer. Gabe. Several people told us today that Officer Hare spent his life giving back across the communities of Logan, Tucumcari, and Raton. Not just as an officer, but a volunteer with a local Little League and a local fire department. He was just a good, easy, friendly face to be around. He's just a man of honor. You couldn't ask for a better officer. A man dedicated to those around him. Someone you never saw without a smile. That's how friends describe fallen NMSP officer Justin Hare. He was a very dedicated father, um, very dedicated to Desiree. I think that their relationship was a very beautiful relationship, um, very loving, very kind. Hare spent six years with NMSP, but before that, Hare worked at the Raton Airport. By 2012, he was a volunteer firefighter near Raton, like his grandfather. Hare was a founding member of Colfax County's Rapid Response. And that's when you know we first started attending meetings here at the courthouse um, in, in Raton that we started uh, pretty much um, talking and connecting. Hare left firefighting in 2018, eventually graduating from the State Police Academy. He will be going to Tucumcari, New Mexico. There, he lived with his girlfriend and their two daughters, and Officer Hare was their t-ball coach. He was a go-getter. He would run around with the kids. He would just be there with a smile on his face saying, come on, like, you know, go get him. Like, wasn't afraid to, to you know, encourage them. As an officer, he made friends with Jack's truck repair in Tucumcari. He was just always hanging out, coming in and borrowing tools, you know, asking for advice. So it it really, this one hit home like it, it almost feels like, he, you know, one of ours is, is gone. Often going the extra mile to help stranded drivers. He was the type of person who would probably pull over and see if he could lend a hand. Um, and the the hard the hard part about the reality of what's going on is that that's exactly what he was doing. This afternoon, Hare's remains were transported from the medical examiner's office in Albuquerque to a nearby mortuary. A vigil is in honor of Officer Hare is planned for Wednesday night at the state police office in Tucumcari. Back to you. All right, thank you, Gabe.